The essence of the Japanese Jello brand Vetro is super fun and super artsy. Vetro continues to keep up and establish new trends. If you are a nail art aficionado, you do not want to ignore it. Everything Vetro has to offer in its versatile line of potted soft gel. If you've been following Vetro since its appearance in the US back in 2015, then you know of its wildly popular products like its Leaf series, which showcase metallic shades of leaf, metallic paper, like gold leaf, for example, in gel, which applied oh so smooth and thin. You may also know them for having popularized the one coat coverage black and white gels. Prior to their introduction, boy did we struggle here in the US with finding a solid black and white for either full coverage or line work. And for me, one of my all time favorites since their debut here in the US was Extension Clear. Like OMG, who knew a structured soft gel could be so strong and long lasting. I was able to use it on any length nails, including long natural nails and freeform extensions. But actually, these are not our three highlight products of today's video, although these are still truly game changing. <music> Hey there and welcome back. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Paola of paulafonsanails.com, your source for all things premium soft gels and entrepreneurship in the nail industry. If you'd like to continue growing with me, then at the end of this video, do consider subscribing. Vetro Game Changing Product Number One, Base Max. Base Max can be used on natural nails in two thin coats if you want a short wear and easy to soak off gel mani. It is sanding free, which means the nails do not have to be prepped with a buffer or file. Simply remove all cuticle and cleanse with alcohol. But over the years, its use has evolved. And this is why I'm ranking it as a game-changing product today. Base Max by Vetro can be used over hard enhancements like acrylics, hard gels, and full coverage tips before color or in between layers of nail art so as to not add bulk to your design or enhancement. Its thin watery consistency also allows it to fill underneath a gel nail where it has lifted. For example, say you have a super tiny but super annoying little bit of lifting where you don't want to remove and reapply the gel nail because unfortunately that is what you'll have to do. Well, Base Max can help you easily repair that lift. Simply buff to remove shine, apply and tuck Base Max underneath and finish with top gel. Vetro game changing product number two, Art Clear Mizuame Non-Wipe 3D Gel, we'll just say Mizuame for short, is a mighty gel you can create high race designs with like stitch knit sweaters, as well as embedding big crystals with a pointed back into it. I've even used Mizuame somewhat thin to embed the tiniest of studs so they don't have to just be like these huge crystals that you're embedding into the gel. Mizuami is really high in viscosity. Its name is actually the word used in Japan for a clear, thick, sticky liquid used for Japanese confections. And thus far on my design that I'm actually wearing right now, it's worked like a charm, no pun intended. Not a single little embellishment or stud has fallen off. And I've done major spring work outside already. I'm talking a lot. So I'm super impressed. Mizuami Suwame is also a non-wipe gel. So once you've embedded your embellishments, no need to top gel. And another good use for it being non-wipe is the ability to burnish chrome pigments right on after curing. And don't forget to double seal those, of course, for long wear. Just a little note, even though it's high viscosity makes it versatile for nail art styles, it's not like the putty gel that you get to roll and create 3D pieces on the nail like ring nail art. It's just there for you to create raised art. Vetro Game Changing Product number three, non-wipe feather top coat. This is everything you've wanted your matte top gel to do, plus it self-levels your entire application like a dream. I remember applying this over a set of nails, just a-okay smooth, like maybe I wasn't like flawless on my structure, but once I applied this, matte top gel it self level everything so perfectly and hit all of the imperfections or any little divots that i had in my application now some people do wonder or 
want to ask if it remains matte because they've noticed that when you apply a matte top gel on your gel nails um, that the matte top doesn't really remain truly truly matte and I must say like mine is still kind of matte but it's definitely more on the satin kind of matte not like a true I don't know velvety matte or like textured matte but i mean it still looks matte just not that strong matte effect otherwise i would caution you because you're really gonna like that self-leveling aspect if you do try it and for that reason alone it may become a favorite if you're okay within like the two week mark not having like a strong matte effect but still matte Listen, everything that we've just highlighted are just a few standout products from Vetro Japanese Show. If you want to learn more about this premium made from scratch Japanese shell nail brand, enrollment for our 2023 Vetro product certification, which only happens once per year, is now open, but only for a very limited time. If you're new to Japanese Show or want to explore the brand in full and learn how to apply it safely and appropriately for long wear, then I'd love for you to join us in a couple of weeks for Vetro certification. Dedicated, not willing to cut any corners, responsible DIYers are welcome. I'll drop the link in the description box below if you'd like to read all of the details or are ready to sign up. And if right now it is not the best time for you to enroll, but you still want to learn more about Japanese gel, do check out my free masterclass. The link for that is also down in the description box below. Vetro was not only one of the very first brands of potted Japanese soft gel, like actually manufactured in Japan, but also in bringing this niche of potted soft gel and lots of nail art to the US. Either way, you have a merry start to the week. Thanks for kicking it off with us and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching and if you found this video valuable would you do me a favor and give it a thumbs up so that i may help more people do check out the description box below for any current resources and promo codes thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one